This is Twit. Digit is an app that it saves money automatically by attaching to your bank account. I've been using it for over a year at this point. Oh, wow. Um, what it does is it attaches to your bank account, it tracks your income and your spending, um, and it automatically drafts money based on your habits so you can afford it. So basically, it knows what you can afford to save, and it'll put that away. Um, you can set it up to save for specific goals or just to put into a random fund like I have one that's saving just for, you know, whenever you need it, um, you know, one that's saving up for, you know, like maybe a gift for somebody or something like that. Um, you don't have to do anything once it's set up. You just attach your bank account and let it run wild. Uh, you can also manually save if you want, like you can see on one of those screenshots. Um, it automatically puts the money into an FDIC insured account so it's safe and you can take it out anytime you want for free. Um, it's free for the first 100 days and then you pay $2.99 a month. And actually, just today, as I was uh, putting together my notes about it, they announced a new feature called Digit Pay, which you can set up to have the app save, put money away that you would otherwise just save. It would put it away to automatically paying off a credit card, which I think is ridiculously cool. Oh, nice. But yeah, it's free for the first 100 days. Uh, it's two ninety a month, two ninety nine a month. Uh, it's available on Android and iOS, and you can actually use it just through text, too, if you want. But I think it's a really cool app. That's awesome. Um, t removing the the thought and intention behind saving and you know yep. all that kind of stuff, it's, it's definitely a theme. I've seen different apps tackle it from, from different you know directions, and I think that's super effective, right? Like, if, if you don't have to think about it, and it just happens, and it and it happens responsibly, right? Like mm -hmm. you don't want to just take yeah. it out a hundred dollars and maybe you don't have the, the money to cover it, but it sounds like it's, it's kind of analyzing what you have and, and making a safe determination. Have you found that that determination to be kind of within the realm of, of acceptability with, with what you happen to have in an account? Yeah. Um, when I, when you first start using it, it spends a couple of weeks tracking your uh, income to make sure like I'm not going to take out this much on payday, but it will look at it and say, okay, I can take, you know, a couple bucks here, a few cents here, and then throw it in based on what you make. It depends on how it, the, it's more effective depending on how you get paid. Like if you get paid weekly, this works really, really well. If you get paid like I do, where you get paid at the beginning of the month and the end of the month, it doesn't work as well, but it still works really. It still does. It takes all the guesswork and the planning out of saving money because you can just let it run and then look and it's like oh there's a couple hundred bucks i didn't know i had yeah oh not bad right on it's called digit and mm -hmm. uh it's free to check it out and then what did you say 2.99 uh, a month yes awesome cool great pick love it digit